Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Troy Goldie, marriage officer, with you once again for another vlog in my series of vlogs about the wedding venues here in the Western Cape that I do weddings at. And uh, yes, I'm a marriage officer and I've been doing weddings for about 19, almost 20 years now. And uh, in all that time, I've never been to this wonderful venue as far as I know. Now, in that 19 years, I've been to many, many venues. So it could be that I've been there many years ago and I just cannot remember. Very, very possible. Uh, but it certainly doesn't sound familiar. And uh, when I looked at the actual venue on YouTube, uh, not YouTube, on uh, Google, uh, it didn't look familiar. So I'm looking forward to come, coming here, looking forward to showing you around. And uh, it's always nice to be able to show you a new place that I've never been to before. And uh, yeah, I'm going to be turning up here shortly. And where am I going? Kronenberg, uh, Kronenberg Estate. And uh, it's a beautiful day. It's a Saturday. It is the 12th of May 2018. And today is very, very special. I've been looking forward to today because straight after this wedding, I am going with my wife, sister-in-law, brother-in-law, and we are going away for the weekend to celebrate my wife's 50th birthday. Happy birthday, Fuzzy! Fuzzy is her nickname, uh, my wife that is. And uh, the reason for Fuzzy is because she's very fussy. But she couldn't say fussy, she said fuzzy. And it just stuck by. And uh, yeah, this is Cronenberg Estate. No, it don't look familiar at all. And uh, so I'm sure that I will uh, recognize it if I saw it. Uh, maybe I should stop here for security, maybe not. See anybody, anybody, anybody? Nobody, 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 nobody. Hello, sir. Lekker, going like a Boeing. Wedding. Wedding? Yeah, boy. Huh? Huh? Not a trouble, no wedding. No, no, no. Oh, sure, but then I must be at the wrong place, because I'm an English wedding man. I'm an English wedding man. Yeah, not a trouble, man. Oh, we don't need a trouble wedding. Okay, my name is Troy, which is close to trouble, so that could work. Okay, my name is Thais. No, no, it's far from trouble. Yeah, yeah. Trouble, trouble, trouble. Is it diesel? Oh, okay. I don't like my dry. Okay. Okay, cool. Don't run away, just stay here. Okay. Are you? You okay? Can't speak, really. Okay. <laughs> Please be seated. Girls, you can stay here for a, just a moment. Ladies, I should say. 
good afternoon. Can you all hear me? Really? Mommy, can ask that question because nobody said yes. Are you here to have some fun? This is going to be like no wedding you've ever been to before. This is not a typical wedding. This is Conrad and Kirsten's wedding. <laughs> Just checking. I asked, I asked Conrad before we started if he knew who he was marrying and he said yes, so that's good. But you are here to witness such an amazing event in the lives of these two wonderful people. And it's important that you feel welcome. Do you feel welcome? Doesn't sound like it. Come people, you have to be involved. Do you feel welcome? Yes. There we go. There we go. You are here, you are chosen to be here today to share this moment with this wonderful couple. And it gives me such great pleasure on their behalf to welcome you to this wonderful event. And I just want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for taking the time, putting the energy and the money, the investment to be here. And they really, truly appreciate it. Thank you very much. You guys can stand next to each other. If I could ask you just to stand a little bit back, a little bit onto the carpet there. There we go. And now, Kirsten? Me. He's nothing important. Me. Can I ask you a favor? I want you just to look at your, your people. Just, just turn around and face them for a moment. Conrad, you can also face your people. I want to just ask the question, does Kirsten look absolutely gorgeous? You know what, I cannot believe it because you do, you look stunningly beautiful and I know that Conrad, when you saw her walking down the aisle, can I tell you something, your wife never looks more beautiful than she looks on the day that you get married. In that white dress. It's worse from here. <laughs> I didn't say anything, she said it, I didn't say it, okay. But Conrad, you, you agree, I know you, I noticed you didn't say anything when I said that, you didn't go, Ooh, anything like that. Um, but she does look gorgeous, doesn't she? I can't speak it Okay, now that we know that um, Kirsten lives up to expectation, now we're going to ask her about Conrad. Does Conrad look okay? <laughs> Conrad, you look gorgeous, my friend. Very, very nice. Okay, guys, I wanted you just to, I wanted your guests to see you guys, to look at you. Because what I look at when I stand in front of a couple ready to marry them is I look at a beautiful couple, gorgeously in love, dressed up to the nines, looking fantastic. And you know what? You guys have spent, well, not you, but you've spent hours getting yourself just perfect. Okay? Maybe you just spent hours, I don't know. Did he spend hours? No, no. You know what, but you spend a long time getting yourself looking just fantastic. But guys, you're not here because of the fact that you wanted to dress up and look beautiful. You could have done that anyway. And each one of these people that are here today to celebrate with you, you could have gathered these people just for a party. And you could have had that party next door. But that's not the reason that you are here. You are here because of the fact that you love each other. And I want to ask that question and I need you to acknowledge that you do love each other. So, quick question. Conrad, do you love Kirsten? Is that a question? <laughs> is that a question? It is a question, yes. Um, Kirsten, do you love Conrad? More than anything else. More than anything else. Fantastic. <laughs> Kirsten, that feeling that you have for Conrad, that feeling when you hear his voice, when you see him for the first time, when you see him for the first time after he comes home from work, what is that feeling? That is the most real feeling that you will have. Guys, I don't want you to take that feeling for granted. I want you to hang on to that feeling. You have the ability, choose to be the most positive voice in each other's life. Build each other up with what you say and how you say it. And the E in love is the simplest of all things because that's simply effort. If you truly love each other, nothing's too much effort to do for the other. I take you, Kirsten. I take you, Kirsten. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise to share. I promise to share. My life with you. My life with you. To keep you. To keep you. 
sleeping your life away. From sleeping your life away. <laughs> To speak, that's a first for me. To speak truthfully to you. <laughs> to speak truthfully to you. To respect you. To respect you. To always be kind. To always be kind. And selfless. And selfless. To always be there for you. To always be there for you. In the toughest of times. In the toughest of times. To be your best friend. To be your best friend. To always make you laugh. To always make you laugh. To love you forever. To love you forever. <sighs> Kirsten, if you could repeat these words, please. I promise not to sleep my life away. No. Conrad? Conrad? I promise to share my life with you. I promise to share my life with you. To speak truthfully to you. To speak truthfully to you. And to respect you. And to respect you. As an individual. I will be kind, I will be kind unselfish, unselfish, and trusting. And trusting. I, promise to love you I promise to love you through good fortune, through good fortune and, adversity. and adversity. And most of all, and most of all I, promise I promise that I will be your best friend. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Rus And that is that, ladies and gentlemen. That is the wedding of Conrad and Kirsten. What an amazing wedding it was. A fantastic time I had. Uh, I think they had a great time as well. And uh, yeah, beautiful place, Grunenberg. First time there. Awesome, awesome place. It was lovely to be there. Thanks, guys. Thanks for having me. Uh, thank you for allowing me to vlog uh, your wedding. It, it was awesome. And uh, both of you looked fantastic. Uh, Kirsten, you did look a little bit better, I must admit, but Conrad, you looked great as well. Guys, if you want to contact uh, DJ Dean, DJ Dean is the uh, DJ that was on duty today. Fantastic guy, uh, professional beyond professional. Please feel free, I'm going to put his details on screen now. Um, I uh, often do weddings with him uh, there in uh, at Hutton's. He's the preferred supplier there as well. Uh, so please give him a shout and I'm sure he will be able to help you as well. And uh, yeah, Cronenberg, give them a shout. Their details, unfortunately, didn't get anybody from Cronenberg to say hi to me. Uh, and I didn't really have a chance to say hello to anybody myself. Um, or even to say hi there myself. Uh, I walked around and I did do some filming so uh, I'm gonna just put that why I did put that on the vlog which you've obviously had a chance to have a look at uh, but uh, Krinnenberg what an amazing wonderful place uh, so guys contact them I really look forward forward to doing more weddings at Krinnenberg it's gonna be absolutely awesome all right so my name Troy Goldie marriage officer it's been fantastic my contact details are on screen now you're more than welcome to contact me you can contact me via my cell number, my landline number, or my email address. And by all means, if you want to, you are more than welcome to also contact me using my Facebook page. But I would suggest that the uh, email is the best, better, and most efficient way of doing it. So guys, from my side, once again, to Conrad and Kirsten, congratulations, guys. It's been an absolute pleasure to be part of your day. And I look forward to hearing how things go for you. For the rest of you, thank you for joining me. Uh, I look forward to the next wedding. Uh, there is a bit of a gap, and hopefully, I'm going to get a couple of vlogs out and uh, get them up on uh, up on my YouTube channel. Uh, so, Troy Goldie from my side, guys, live long, live well, live like there's no tomorrow, and remember, 
love unconditionally until next time cheers bye bye